Welcome to the Terror of Cyber Kaiju event. Things are about to get spooky as hell around here. I bring to you our host, Ultraman Belial, who will utilize his Giggle Battle Miser to resurrect the villain from Ultraman's past. Who will it be to start things off today, Belial? Ah yes, the final boss of the original Ultraman series, Zeton. Zetan is one of the most iconic beasts from the entire Ultraman series, having various forms throughout the saga and reappearing frequently in recent years. So how did Tomashi Nations do with this release? Well, honestly, they nailed it. Zetan is a simpler design when it comes to the paint and it shows. Your main colors here are mainly blacks and whites, with little bits of silver used on the antenna and silver dots on the back of his carapace. And of course, those translucent yellowish-orange gems on Zetan's body are the true show stealers here. I don't know what the exact name for them are called, so don't ask. This insectoid-like space dinosaur really does look intimidating, and it's captured wonderfully here in figure arts form. While in terms of articulation, Zetan here moves well enough. You will be limited moving around the head thanks to the sculpt getting in the way, but Zetan never really did move the head around too much. My only gripe with this one is I've noticed that the leg joints becoming a bit too weak over time, which can make posing with him a little bit of a hassle considering how much give there is. Zetan shines with two beam effects. First you have it in the absorbing face, where the end is sculpted to match the sculpt of the Sparion Ray from the original Ultraman release. And then you have the Zetan final beam. Both have a clear translucent sculpt that transitions to a yellowish tint towards the end of the beam. Both already come with the pre-sculpted hands to hold them, so just be cautious when swapping them around. Here are some size comparisons with other figures in my personal collection. I really do love Zeton's design, and this release is solid and definitely worth picking up. Just recently, however, it was revealed that Zeton will be getting a repaint treatment as the Trillion Degree Fireball Edition. It has an orange glow around the gem of the face and a fireball effect piece to accompany it. It's a toss up for me honestly, I can go either way all things considered. So if you can hunt this one down, definitely do so, if not, maybe wait for that version. Anyways, that's the end of this review. I hope you guys enjoyed it and do consider picking one of these up in the near future. The Terror of Cyber Kaiju event is continuing on today, so definitely head on to the next video from my fellow content creator and definitely check it out. Alright everybody, I'll see you all tomorrow. Collect everything, connect everything, and Card is here with other videos you might be interested in, so definitely check those out when you get the chance.